The vacuum pump comes with several components and accessories, including a one liter container of vacuum oil. Be sure the voltage of the vacuum pump is compatible with your freeze dry system. Remove one of the oil plugs. Fill it until the oil level reaches the top line of the sight glass. Set the gas ballast to zero. Now add the inlet adapter. Remove the dust cap and place the three quarter inch hose adapter onto the existing centering ring and filter assembly. Place the clamp around the adapter and the inlet port and tighten for a good seal. Remove the installed gray exhaust port using a crescent wrench. Connect the exhaust filter to the exhaust filter adapter included in the filter kit. Place the centering ring onto the exhaust filter. Then place the adapter on top, clamp, and tighten. Now you're ready to connect the vacuum pump to the system. If you have a Labconco rotary vein pump, it easily fits inside the cabinet. Connect the freeze dryer vacuum hose and inlet adapter and tighten the clamp. Check all connections for a secure fit. The freeze dryer uses three quarter inch hose connections. If you've purchased a pump other than Lab Conco's, verify that it has a three quarter inch inlet for connection to the freeze dry system. Be sure the pump is in the off position. Connect the pump's power cord directly to the receptacle labeled vacuum pump and turn it on.